Using construction lines can be cumbersome. In this lesson, we're going to use a tool called temporary tracking that will enable us to create geometry without doing the math for these continuous dimensions and construction lines to locate a point in space. Let's start creating a new drawing by clicking this plus sign. Go to view and select tile vertically. And in order to move this window to the other side, just highlight it and click tile vertically. Go down to the status bar and make sure your dynamic input is on. I'm just going to adjust the screen. And let's start with line command. Click anywhere on the window and enter one unit. And as you can see here, the distance from this corner to this corner is 1. But the distance from this point to this point is not given. Unless you deduct 1 point from 4. But we don't want to do the math. So click line again. And shift right click to select temporary track point. Hover over this end, don't click, just bring down your cursor and enter 4 units. And move your cursor to the right and enter 1.75. Right click to repeat line and enter 6.5. Bring down your cursor and enter 1. To locate this point, we have to use temporary tracking again. So type L for line command and shift right click and select temporary track point. Hover over, then click and move your cursor to the right for 1.5 units. And bring it down for one unit. And the dimension here is 3.5. Enter and bring it down for one unit. And click enter. Repeat line and just track. And enter. Repeat line again, shift right click, temporary tracking point, and as you know the distance from this point to this end is 2.75, so just hover over and enter 2.75 and bring it down, track from here, Bring up your cursor, track again, and connect that line. Right click to repeat line and enter one unit. Repeat line again. And enter. I'm just gonna make sure. I'm gonna check the distance from this point to this point. Yeah, we got it right. And this point here is not given either. So I'm gonna start from this point. So line, shift right click and temporary track point and Hover over, don't click, and move your cursor to the right for 4.75. I'm 
and bring down your cursor and just track here click right click to repeat line now this one drawing is done I'm just gonna erase this drawing and do another exercise Let's do this base plate. So type L for line command. Click anywhere on the window or on the screen for four units. And move to the right for 5.5. Bring your cursor up for two units. Right click to repeat line, click the end point, and enter 4.25. To locate the center point of the circle, we have to use temporary track point again. So type C for circle command, shift right click. And select temporary track point and uh, as you can see the distance from the left is one unit and uh, from this corner is 2.5 so we'll start from here just hover over don't click and enter one unit and bring your cursor up for 2.5 enter D for diameter option and enter one unit right click to repeat circle and same process shift right click and select temporary track point hover over then click and move your cursor to the right for three units and bring it up and you can see that green line moving and enter 1.5 and type D for diameter option and enter one right click to repeat circle and enter D for diameter option and enter two we're done thank you for watching and comment below if you like what I did or click like and see you again and please don't forget to subscribe bye bye